If you're curious what's still available at the One Lake community, these new construction homes, very unique. We're on the lake right now, as you can see. We're gonna break that down for you in this video. We are gonna go over not only the availabilities, but the amenities you'll get here, along with the incentives that they're offering at One Lake here in Fairfield, California. Let's, Let's go. go. Welcome back to the channel. For those of you who that are new, I'm Lily Ratliff. I'm Brandon Ratliff. And we are a husband and wife real estate team here in Northern California who specialize in Solano County. Yes, Lily and I have been living in Solano County for over 10 years now. And we've been helping people just like you buy, sell, invest, and relocate here in Solano County. And we absolutely love it. We do. So whether you're thinking of moving in the next nine days or 90 days, we want to be your go-to resource. We want to be able to help. So give us a call, text, email, or even schedule a Zoom meeting in the description in the link below. All right, but let's get at it. We are here at One Lake, this awesome community of new construction homes here in Fairfield, California. And this has been a community that's been very popular, both with people from within Solano County and people out. You know, we've helped people from out of state and the Bay Area get homes here. And guess what, 2024, they still have four communities that are offering homes. So we wanna give you an update on the availability and the incentives. But first, let's go ahead and talk about this community, what it has to offer and what you can expect from its location. Now let's talk about the location because I think that's what attracts a lot of people and families to this area. You're about a mile away from the Fairfield Vacaville Amtrak corridor. You're about a mile away from Travis Air Force Base. Oh, you can hear right now. There goes no, the Amtrak. There's the Amtrak right, right there. there. Um, we're about 35 minutes away from Sacramento, the capital here, and it's close to 680. You know, if you're looking to go to the East Bay, Warner Creek, or even Napa Valley, you're about 25, 30 minutes from there. And about 45 minutes away from San Francisco, the Bay Area. Yeah, so we do see a lot of people coming from the Bay Area here. Not only is it more affordable, and it kind of gives them that suburban lifestyle, that calmer, slower pace that they're looking for, mm -hmm. but it also gives you that convenience, either if you're commuting yourself or you want to take public transportation like the Amtrak, you can do so. It goes all the way to Sacramento and the Bay Area, and you can go to your work that one time a week that you need to, and then come right back and then be in paradise. Yeah, we talked to a lot of families and people that are in this area, and they do commute to the Bay Area, like you said, mm -hmm. you know, once a week, twice a week. A lot of remote work is happening these days, and so this just allows you to be in that centrally located spot, and it's still very much commuter friendly. Another great thing about this location, any home here in the One Lake community, you're gonna be in the Travis Unified School District. That is rated number two on niche.com in all of Solano County. And what's even nicer is that the middle school and the high school are gonna be less than five minutes away. <laughs> Everything's going to be pretty close to you here at One Lake when you're talking about schools. It'll be five or 10 minutes away from shops in either Vacaville or Fairfield. What's cool about this space is they have a Journeys here. Now, Brandon, what is Journeys for people who aren't familiar with Solano County. So Journeys is a local coffee shop that's pretty much everywhere here in Solano County. Mm -hmm. But you have the glass house right behind us. And what's great about this, they don't only serve coffee and tea, mm -hmm. they serve breakfast, they serve lunch and dinner. So it's one of those places where you don't really have to go anywhere, right? You don't. You, and we actually know friends, people who come here to work during the day, even if uh -huh. they don't live here or come to walk, they get lunch, catch up with friends. So this really has become a really cool community, both for people who live here and just locals alike, just come and enjoy this beautiful landscape. So before we stop and show you the Clay Clubhouse, we wanted to share, do like a little 180 here. You see a plane flying right above us. That's where you're gonna get here as well. Mm -hmm. You're gonna get planes flying overhead. And we do notice, you know, people who are going to be stationed here at Travis Air Force Base, everyone that we've helped, they don't really have a problem with plane sounds. That's as close as it's going to get. So if that's something that you think would bother you, now you know. I mean, that's literally what it looks like. But it's really, I would say, pretty minimal, right? Yeah, it's minimal. It flies by and it's goodbye, you know? It flies by. Yeah, there you <laughs> go. And then right behind us, we're going to go ahead and stop. Let's talk about all the amenities of One Lake because there's a lot, and that's really what I think makes this community stand out when you're talking about any other new construction communities. And this is it. And what is that, Brandon? That is the Lake Clubhouse. That should be coming soon this year. 2024. Uh, we don't have a hard date, but it is coming this year sometime. But what's great about this is if you're a resident here, you get access to this. This is a lot of amenities. You get the, you know, the event center here, the pool, the child splash pad. There's a lot of things spa, coming here. Spa, event center, workspace. Little, just right? a lot of things that you can work, live, play, do the whole thing. That's what One Lake was really, you know, created for, was to have that California lifestyle, that indoor-outdoor lifestyle. This Lake Club is going to help you do it. 
Now, two other amenities that you're going to get here are going to be one, the Grove, which we think is a really cool feature to have. It's basically this organic farm. The kids come, you can literally text the gardener and say, hey, I need leeks, I need onions, I need, I need squash, kale. beets. Yeah, I need something. Right now they have sunflowers, right? It's very seasonal. So it's a really cool feature to have. Along with, if you're a dog person, this is gonna be a great place for you. They're gonna be building two dog parks, one for large dogs and one for small dogs. Now, before we talk about the updates in the new community here at One Lake, we do want to preface this. Make sure you use a realtor when you come to visit mm -hmm. these homes. It is very important. We actually were shooting this video when we just passed a woman who said, I saw your Stop video. Stop mid-jog. <laughs> Stop mid-jog. I saw your video and I bought here because of you guys. Yes. But she didn't call us, which is okay. Not everyone's going to call. It happens. But you should use a realtor to negotiate and show you the ins and outs and why it's important to um, have someone to advocate on your behalf. And possibly negotiate thousands of dollars for you, either in credits or in closing costs to buy down your rate. Kind of help you ask the questions that you may not even think of because, again, it's not going to cross your mind. And guess what? The builder it represents the builder. Yep. So they're going to get as much money for the builder as they possibly can while maybe still answering your questions. They're not going to necessarily tell you what questions you should be asking. Right. So lean on a realtor. Make sure you consult with somebody before going in there. It's just going to help you out in the long run. Mm -hmm. um, but you do hear noises around. Now, what you is hear that? hammering. It's like a new construction community or something. So let's just turn around here. You can kind of see what they're doing behind us. They are building homes, right? It's in progress. So I guess that's a perfect segue, really, that construction. <laughs> to talking about the availabilities of the communities here. And we're going to start with Lakeside, which is right here the homes that as you guessed it are on the lake so if you want to be on the lake you want to be next to everything happening you want to be in the know you want to people watch from your backyard yeah you know be able to walk to the events that they have here be able to go to journeys in the morning and pick up a cup of coffee then you're going to, want to be at lakeside by brookfield residential mm -hmm. these town homes right behind us you hear the pounding away because mm -hmm. they're building up for who for you <laughs> for you i mean they have town homes that are available to move in as soon as now, March, and even May of this year. Now, what's important to note about these townhomes, they're not gonna be side to side, but rather they're gonna be stacked. So you could either have a lower unit or you could have a top unit. They're gonna range anywhere from about 1,400 square feet to about 2,300 square feet. Now the top unit, those are gonna be a little larger. Those are gonna be those about 22 to 2,300 square foot units. And you'll get that nice covered balcony on top. Let's just stop right here so you can kind of get the yes. idea. Or is that lower one? You'll actually get, if you want to maybe put some plants in, you'll be able to do that on the lower unit. Yes, it's smaller, but you also have a covered patio there. And I mean, the view is not so bad, just saying. Yes, yeah, so if you look at for backyard space, I mean, you're not going to have it in the upper unit, but look, yeah, you said the views here. Let's just do a 360 real quick. Mm -hmm. And I mean, your the only views. real outside space is going to be in the front. So it's not necessarily going to be private, but it's going to have a stunning view. So if you can live with that, these are going to be great homes for you. So you're probably thinking to yourself, I get water views, I'm next to all the things happening. Brendan and Lily, what are the prices of these homes? Now they're gonna be starting at 599,000, all the way up to 650 plus. Mm -hmm. And there really is, that's gonna be the range you're going to see. And the homes that they're building right now that are going to be ready, well, they're gonna be, as we just saw, sort of right here on this side of the lake. Now we talk about the incentives. This is what's actually kind of cool right now. You know, we are seeing rates a little higher than usual. They're at that mid sixes right now. And because of that, they are still offering amazing incentives, mm -hmm. which for these particular community, they're offering $30,000 as sort of flex cash, which means you can use it for a lot of different reasons. Brandon, what are, what are the reasons you could use that for? So huh? some of the things you can use it for is a solar. You can apply that to the solar. You can use that for closing cost credit. Mm -hmm. So you can save more money in pocket. Um, you can use that to buy down the rate yep. to make your payment more affordable. Design options perhaps, Design right? Options. If that's where you're at in the phase. Mm -hmm. So there's a lot of different things that you can do. And that is a huge perk right now to maybe, you know, utilizing or leveraging the market that we're currently in to get more money back in your pocket. So if you don't want to be right on the lake, you want some privacy, you want that side yard, well, you have that option. So we are now walking in the Horizon community. To give you some perspective, we're on the other side of the lake. So if you want that privacy, you 
you want that side yard, these aren't gonna be stacked units. They're gonna be side-by-side -side townhomes as well. These are gonna be two-story homes. They're gonna be three to four bedrooms, 2,000 to 2,300 square feet, and they're gonna start at 625,000 all the way to $660,000. Yeah, so it's a little bit of a higher price range, but you're getting, for the most part, a little bit more square footage and more privacy and more land, so that's right. where that comes from. And it's kind of a nice balance, again, if you wanna be on the lake, but you don't wanna have a, a huge home and a huge lot to take care of, but you still want your own space. Maybe you don't want your, you have a dog, you don't want them barking at people as they walk across the lake every single day. Yeah, let me tell you, there's a lot of people walking and jogging here. But Horizon is going to be a great place for you if those are what you're looking for. Now, if you're looking for something a little bit bigger, a little bit more privacy and actual single family homes, well, that's when we're gonna go ahead and shift and take you to some of the communities that Tri Point Homes is building here in one lake. Ooh, let's go. Let's go. Now, let's talk about single family homes. The Shimmer community is already sold out, but don't worry. The good news is you can splash into something a little bigger. Oh God, can you guys tell he's a dad? <laughs> so the splash community, they're gonna have bigger homes. You're gonna have more space outside, more space inside. We're talking 2,300 square feet, all the way to 2,800 square feet. And where are the prices gonna start here? So the prices are gonna be anywhere from the low 700s up to a little over $750,000. And we'll still get you more space. You're still gonna be very close to that lake club. You're gonna be close to the lake, but again, you'll have single family residences. So you don't have to share a wall with anybody. And you get a little bit more design options when it comes to TriPoint Home, who is the builder of this community. Yes, and we can speak from experience. We've helped clients from the channel Maybe we're walking by their house right now. I don't know. <laughs> Coincidentally, we are. Um, but they absolutely love it here. They love it. They do, and the whole process was very, very smooth. We have nothing but good things to say about TriPoint Homes, which brings us to availability. Now, right now, there is only one home that they have available to move in soon. They do have all the other plans uh, available for you to design, right? But that those prices are totally going to flex depending on your design options and everything else you do to those homes. But if you don't mind a quick move in, are privy to $25,000. What? Yes, that's, that's flex credit that it's you could apply to. It's a little to, bit more appealing now, just saying. Right, right. That you could apply to closing cost credit like we talked about before. Mm -hmm. You can apply that to uh, the rate buy down, Solar. to buy down the rate to make your payment more what? Mm -hmm. Affordable. Affordable. <laughs> um, Sorry guys. But you can just use it for anything you'd like. Mm -hmm. But let's say you want even more space than what Splash can offer. Well, Tricorn has one other community that they are continuing to build out. And these are the largest homes in one lake. We're talking over 3,000 square feet with the ability or the option to have a gen suite within the home. And we're talking about the Glisten community. What's a gen suite? Well, let's go talk about it and we'll show you the neighborhood now. Let's go. So we are here at the Glisten community because we heard you speaking. You want something bigger. You want something more private. And you just need to accommodate your family. Mm -hmm. Well, these are gonna do that. These are the biggest homes here at One Lake. They're gonna be the four to five bedrooms. They're gonna have the two car garages and everything is just more grand here. Yes, and 3,000 up to 3,500 square feet, including, like we mentioned, the gin suite option. Gin suite is, again, what is that? You know, let's finally <laughs> answer this mystery for you guys. Well, the gin suite is essentially a in-law suite. Now this could house anybody, right? This could be grandparents, your kids coming back from college, maybe your guests if you want to give them a very nice setup. But it's not just a bedroom, it's gonna have a walk-in closet, the ensuite bathroom, it's gonna have a flex living space with a kitchenette, so they really can have their own life and still be in the same house, which we find a lot of people are wanting right now. And if you're one of those people that this is intriguing to, this sounds very interesting, well, you're going to be in luck because they do have one available in March to purchase that has the gin suite in it. But this will come at a price. These are the most expensive homes in the One Lake community. And a friendly reminder, all of these move-in homes, doesn't matter what community you're in, they're all going to have the upgrades reflected in the price, right? They've already made all of the options. There's really nothing for you to customize at this point. So it's a matter of, do you like this product? Do you like the features that are in it? And do you like that price? Yes. And like you can see behind us, they are going to continue building. So if you are somebody who wants to design mm -hmm. your own home, you want to pick all your upgrades, all your things, you still can. Yes, Glisten is the least developed community in One Lake. It actually right. started at the very, or it was the last community to start building, and they're going to be building more homes. And it is a little bit more pushed back. I will say, maybe we can do a 360 Brandon and show them, mm -hmm. right? 
you're gonna be a little bit further away from the lake and maybe that's what you want, but you also get lovely views of the rolling hills in the back. And you are right next to a park. Mm -hmm. There's a grass field, you have a park right there, you see it there, it's beautiful. But you do have a lot of different options at Glisten. So if you're either looking to move in soon or if you're looking to plan, like Benny was saying, maybe design your home a little bit more, you have that opportunity. Now these quick move-ins do come with a flex credit of $20,000. That is what we have coming up in the One Lake community. A lot of different options to choose from, whether you want to be on the lake, if you have that smaller 1,400 square foot home, or have a 3,500 square foot home with a gin suite in it, you have all of those options here to choose from at One Lake. So that was our video on beautiful One Lake in Fairfield, California. This is a very unique gem here in Solano County. And right now we are in the Grove here at One Lake. Mm -hmm. This is that garden that we were talking about. The kids are running around, they're playing, <laughs> they get to see all the plants flowering for spring. This is something that you could be a part of. We do want to thank you again for watching this video. We know that time is valuable and we do put a lot of our time into making these worth watching for you. And if you're thinking of making the move to the Solano County or want to know more about this area, give us a call, text, email, or even schedule a Zoom meeting in the description below. We'd love to meet you face to face. Until the next video, Rattlers out. out.